Mickey James found herself quite displeased with the recent events involving her spouse, Nick Aldis, the general manager of WWE SmackDown. On the episode dated December 8, Orton made a comeback and was under the watchful eyes of Aldis and Raw GM Adam Pearce. Choosing SmackDown, Orton delivered an RKO to his new superior. In the following week, Orton settled a $50,000 fine and added another $50,000 earmarked for a future assault on the SmackDown GM. Discussing the incident on the latest Busted Open Radio episode, James expressed her sentiments. I'm perplexed. Honestly, a tad disheartened, remarked James. It was unsettling, although very Randy-esque. One should have anticipated it. Nick was merely trying to conduct good business. Everyone seemed to revel in it, but I felt disheartened because I was looking forward to Randy's return. I even collaborated on a fantastic Randaddy a t-shirt concept. I thought it would be a success, we could have made significant profits together. It was supposed to be fantastic, but then he administers an RKO to my husband after signing the paperwork. I don't understand why. Why not target Adam? Should have RKO'd Adam. Later on, the former WWE Women's Champion highlighted that during the attack, Aldis was donned in a pricey, tailor-made suit, and she was displeased to see it damaged. Aldis assumed the role of SmackDown GM in October. Several weeks later, after an 18-month hiatus from the ring, Orton returned at WWE Survivor Series, War Games 2023.